to pin a post in a Facebook group but don't know how to do it, don't worry. I got you covered in this video how I'm going to show you step by step exactly how you can pin a post inside a Facebook group. Let's go! Yeah. We all win when we all win. We all win when we all win. Hey there my friend, I'm Super C! And I'm an organic marketing coach who has helped hundreds of people build systems so that they could find their next clients online organically for free. And today I'm going to go over with you step by step exactly how you can pin a post inside a Facebook group. Let's go. So first things first, I really want to cover what is a Facebook group, right? I really want to make sure we cover this because pinning a post inside a Facebook group is obviously a great tactic. It's something that we can do. It's a great marketing strategy that we can follow so that more people can see a specific message that we have and want to put out on social media inside a Facebook group. So I want to make sure, but I want to make sure we completely understand what a Facebook group is so that we know at the end of this, when we're pinning this post, you can understand why that we're pinning this post, um, you know, ultimately in the first place. So ultimately what a Facebook group is, is going to be a group of people that you can, you know, create on Facebook and that you can grow and, and, and build and stuff like that. And that you can collaborate with on Facebook that, um, you know, that is usually going to be a group of people on, um, on Facebook that are going to be like-minded or, right, are going to be that group of people that have a common goal that they're all wanting to reach inside that Facebook group. So what does it exactly mean to pin a post inside a Facebook group? And ultimately, what pinning a post inside a Facebook group means is it means you're going to be able to put a post on top of the feed of the discussion inside that Facebook um, group. So say you go into a Facebook group and ultimately when you go inside that Facebook group, you're going to see the discussion, right? The wall of content that's going to be about what people posted inside that Facebook group over the last day, two days, three days, week, forever inside that Facebook group, right? And you're going to be able to scroll through that content. Well, ultimately the reason, I mean, they're ultimately you can pin a post, which is what it's going to do is it's going to take that piece of content that you just put out there and it's going to force that piece of content to stay at the top of that feed inside that Facebook group. So before I go over with you why you would want to do this and ultimately a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to do this inside your Facebook group so that you can use this marketing strategy to get more of your messages seen by more people, I want to remind you to subscribe to this channel. I'm putting out new and exciting videos every single day for people just like you who's looking to find their next clients online organically for free. So make sure to click that button below and subscribe. So why? Why would we want to pin a post in a Facebook group? And I know for a lot of you really smart ones out there, you're sitting out there and it's like, well, it's duh. You got to keep it on the top, right? But I want to remind you, like the, the biggest strategy that this is, it, it's such a huge strategy that you can utilize. That a lot of people don't utilize and you can, you know, really rotate this strategy on top of itself so that you can rotate kind of like an ad inside your Facebook group that can be seen by more and more people inside the Facebook group. So the reason you would, you would want to, or anybody would want to pin, right, a post inside their Facebook group is ultimately because by pinning that post, it refuses um, Facebook of burying that post and ultimately not allowing as many people to have the chance to see that post inside the Facebook group. Because think about it, when someone goes into your Facebook group, usually for the first time, what's the first thing they're going to do? They're going to scroll down. And if you have a pinned post specifically on purpose, that means that you purposely want them because they're a member of the group to see it. So by pinning that post, ultimately you give more of a chance for the people that enter that Facebook group to see specifically that piece, that message and that piece of content that you have pinned inside the Facebook group. All right, so let's go through a step-by-step -step on exactly how you can pin a post inside your Facebook group. And I promise you, it's a lot easier than you think. So this is the Facebook group that I own, one of my communities, ultimately with um, some of my clients in there. And I have, um, you know, a new post that, um, you know, or one that, um, you know, I put up recently that maybe I'd like to pin. And ultimately what I would do is, is I would come down to this post inside this Facebook group. And I could do this with any post, okay? I mean, I could do it with this post. I could really do it with any post that we have in there. But ultimately this would be the post that say I wanted to pin. What I would do is, is I would simply go here to the post and I would click on the menu of this post with the three dots on the top right hand corner here. And ultimately I would wanna mark this as an announcement, okay? So I would simply go in there and I would mark this as an announcement. As you can see in the bottom left-hand corner here, uh, the post has been marked as an announcement. Now, ultimately, after it's marked as an announcement, right, what you're going to see is here is I could easily remove the announcement right from here. But as, when it's marked as an announcement, it's then going to go up here into the announcements. Okay. So once I click on the announcements, as you're going to see, 
It's just gonna go up here in the set of announcements. Now, how do we pin it to the top? Well, after you put it into the announcements, you're gonna see as it's been put here in the announcements, all we would need to do there is click that top right-hand menu button again, right? And simply click on this button right here, which would be classified as pinning it to the top of the announcements, ultimately making now this post in the discussion, right? And as I refresh this page, ultimately making this post um, at the top of the discussion now, the pin post at the top of the group for more people to be able to see this post ultimately, right, inside that Facebook group. Have a Facebook group where you're looking to nurture your prospects and ultimately find your next client? Then my super online organic prospecting system bundle is just for you. And in my super online organic prospecting system bundle, it comprises of three of my top selling courses, ultimately all geared to help you find your next clients online. And right now you can grab your super online organic prospecting system bundle for over 97% off. Just click on the link in the description or head to www.supersidsbundle.com right now today. And don't forget, we all win when we all win. I choose to win today and I hope you choose to win by taking action in the description or heading to www.supersidsbundle.com so that you can take action now on your super online organic prospecting system bundle for over 97% off. We'll see you in the next video. Let's go. We all win when we all win.